Bollocks. Having fun? Not anymore. Don't worry, Nathan. We all dance like pricks when we think no one's looking. Cigarette. It's Friday night. You obviously want to be out dancing somewhere. Why are you here so late? Got bloody papers to mark. Off on holiday Monday. Anywhere nice? Bermuda. You jammy sod. I thought they paid you teachers bugger all. First holiday I've had in five years, outside of a caravan in Great Yarmouth. Even then I seem to always have more work to take with me. No rest for the wicked, eh? Indeed. Just the two of us in the building? Oh, no distractions then. Is that a hint? Well, I know you have to be here all night, but I'm planning not to be. The doors are all locked up. If you need me to open up for you, just give me a shout. Why, where are you going to be? Oh, I'm going to be patrolling the building. You might see me wandering around. But don't let that distract you from your dancing. You need all the practice you can get. Oh, right, cheers for that. I'll <laughs> make you a deal. You don't tell anyone in between patrols I'll be sat down here watching a film, and I won't tell anyone about your Friday night fever. <laughs> mm. All right, deal. <laughs> hey, uh, so what are you watching? Oh, I don't know yet. I'll probably spend half a shift Having a look for something before I decide. Yeah. Well, I could uh, recommend a good book. <laughs> Do me a favour, mate. I'm struggling to stay awake as it is. <laughs> <laughs> Catch you later. Yeah, have a good one.
Stu? Hey, Stu, I heard a noise on my floor. Yeah, that, that was me banging about. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to disturb you. Don't apologise. It's just being paranoid. Hey, I'll pop down for a cigarette in a bit, yeah? Cool. Hello? Who's there? Hello, who is this? Are we still on for tonight? Yeah, definitely. I'm pissed off about my phone, but I'm not going to let it spoil our fun. It'll turn up sooner or later. Good. Got a little bit more work to do, but uh, I'll be finished before you get here. We're going to have fun indeed. I can't wait. Hey, did you just try to call me a minute ago? No. Why? Well, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. I'll see you soon, yeah? Hey, Stu, you coming for a cigarette? Hello? Hello? Stu, I thought it was only me and... Oh, shit!
Do you need me downstairs? Maybe. Do you want to hang out tonight? I can't. Me and Megan are study buddying. Shit, I can't find it. And I'm running late. This is your fault. Mine? You distract me. Where's your phone? Ring mine so I can follow the ring. Uh, no, nah, battery's dead. I'll use a house phone. Yeah, I'm listening. <laughs> Nothing. Must be on silent. Look, I've got to go. If you find it, can you get it to me? Oh, yeah, no worries. Thanks, babe. I wish I could stay here with you. Mm. Oh, Chelsea, what are you saying, sexy? You want to bunk off and get high? Girl, I turn you on like a household appliance. What do you say? You want to go to mine, smoke a bowl and... Uh... I'll show you how fine you really are. What's the point? My girlfriend's probably got a bigger dick. Well, leave it out, bitch. Just fuck off and bother someone else. Can I help you, boys? I don't know, love. You tell me. Nah, you got dibs on Chelsea. This one's mine. psycho. Come on. What did you say to him? It's about Hannah. Get off the pitch, you bellends. What the fuck are you playing at? You're going to get a kick in if you're not careful. What have you done? I haven't done anything. Oh, bollocks, if there's something going on between you two, it ain't going to be her fault. Look, the sun don't shine out our ass, you know. Then why the fuck are you dating her? I don't think I am anymore. What did you do? Look, is your nan home? What? No, she'll be at work. Why? Let's just go back to yours. I don't want to speak about us out in the open. Nan! She's not here, go through. Do you want a brew? No, thanks. Alright, I'm going to put the cat on. No, leave it. Come sit down. I want a brew? Mate, I'm not being a dick. Seriously, come sit down. You're not going to want to wait to hear this. Why have you got Hannah's phone? Where is she? She's at school. I took it from her this morning. Why would you take Hannah's phone? There's something I need to show you. She's been acting weird recently. 
Weird how? I don't know, distant, cold, just different, you know? If you're worried about her dumping you before, then the moment she finds out you've been snooping around on her phone, you'll be ditched. She's cheating on me. <sighs> Mate, that's shit, but what do you want me to do about it? She's my little sister, I can't side with you over her. Mate, do you really think I just came here to tell you that your little sister was fucking somebody? Careful. It's who she's cheating on me with. Who? Mr Shaw. Who? Mr Shaw, her teacher. Oh, bollocks, he's well old. She might have a crush on him or something, but she ain't that stupid. I'm gonna fucking kill him. Yeah. No, I need to go to the police. The pigs? Oh, fuck that. A bunch of useless wankers won't do shit. No, we deal with this ourselves. We? No, I brought you the phone as a courtesy. I'm going to the police. Pussy. No wonder she's cheating on you. She's your missus and you're gonna let some pedo scumbag mess around with her. What'll be your plan then, huh? What, you take the tools on him and get yourself nicked? What would happen to your nan then, huh? What would happen to Hannah? It says here that they're meeting at the school tonight. I've got an idea. This is a bad idea. Ball bags? What's up with you two miserable shits? Normally when I have a pair of bitches delivered to my door, they're smiling from ear to ear. Oh, yeah, come on in. That's proper fucked up. Yep. So, what are we gonna do? We? What are we even doing here? Your uncles do still work at the school. I'll give them a buzz. He seemed like a good guy. What, Mr Shaw? Yeah. Never seen like the pedo type. They never do. They hide in plain sight. Apart from Jimmy Savile, don't know how the fuck no one clocked that nonce. Right, Jim Smoppers? Ready to Danny Glover this predator? Oh, what's she doing here? She has a name, dickhead. Who died and made you king of the world? So it's getting out of hand. Yeah, no offence, Chelsea, but Danny, why did you bring her with you? Why are you asking her that? I'm not some dog she's taken out for walkies. We need to ask ourselves what we're doing here. Ben, you claim you love her, but you've hacked her phone to read her messages. I'm not being funny. You're right. You ain't funny. And I'm not finished. Eve, do you want to protect your sister, or do you want to look macho by beating up some nonce? Ain't that simple, Chels. I'm not trying to talk you out of this. Hannah's going to need us when shit hits the fan. Right, calm down, you guys. Stu's going to be here in a minute. If he spooks, he'll bin us off. All right, all right, you're right. Sorry, Chels. Thank you. I'm sorry for calling you a tosspot. You didn't. I know, but I was thinking it. We all set, Stu. He's up on the third floor in his room. I'll hide you guys in the lobby and see if he wants to come outside for a ciggy. Once we're outside, head up and hide. There's a couple of empty rooms across the corridor from him. Thanks for this, by the way. Don't worry about it, kidder. When Danny told me what this sick fucker was up to, I wanted to level the shit out of him myself. Right. Duck behind here. Wait till we're outside before you move. Give me your coats. What are these for? The answer to that is two from my paranoid chum. Firstly, when he sees us, he's going to shit himself. <laughs> Bonus. Secondly, if it all goes tits up, we ain't going to give ourselves away. It's not actually a bad idea. Anyone going to the match this Saturday? No, I'm working. Probably get spanked anyway, useless tosses. No, I don't know. We were lacking at the start of the season, but I reckon we're in with a good chance this week. Guys, is this really the time to be talking about this? 
just making conversation. Don't get your knickers at a twist. Right, that's his room over there. Ben, me and you are hiding in this room. It's got the best for you. You two duck in that room over there. If we get caught, you might need to help us out. Call Stu, the police if things get really desperate. Are both your phones fully charged? Yeah. Does the Pope shit in the woods? Stick them on silent. Your mouths too. So, what? We just wait. We just wait. And then Hannah arrives and we jump out shouting, gotcha. Essentially, yeah. And you got no fucking clue, do you? I'm the clueless one. Oh, don't make me laugh if we had it your way. If we had it my way, if we had it my way, we wouldn't be here. Hannah wouldn't be walking into danger and Mr Shaw would be getting grilled by the police. When Nan's house was burgled, it took the pigs nine hours to get there when Julia was stabbed last summer. Do you think they tried to catch the scumbag that knived her? Oh, did they? Fuck. They don't care about council house scum like us. We're nothing to them. Christ. You know, Chelsea was right. We should have just gone to Hannah first. Want to know the plan? Well, here's the plan. Got in touch with one of those nonce catcher groups earlier. Told them what was up. I'm gonna live stream off their website, get all the evidence we need. Then the police won't have a choice but to do something. And if they don't, Mr Shaw will be internet famous. Won't be able to go anywhere without getting a kick in. That's not actually a terrible idea. And finally, comes around. Grab this. Hi. Um, so today I found out that my little sister is being groomed by her teacher. God, I hate waiting around. Sweetie, we've been in here 20 minutes. And I'm bored already. I know how we can pass the time. Even with Pedo Pete across the hall. God, I love you. What was that? What was what? I didn't hear nothing. No, I swear I heard something. What the fuck are they playing at? Idiots. They've screwed this up. Shh. Stu? What are you doing? Messaging Stu. Oh, I need a piss. Now? I'm gagging for one. Look, I'll be sneaky, babe. He won't even see me. I'll be back soon. So romantic. Oh, I don't 
can't believe it. Just remember, you invited her. Still got Anna's phone. Withhold the number and call Shaw. Hello? Yes, he's picked up. What do I say? Hang on a sec. needed a piss. Oh. Is that you? No. Oh, shit. What are we going to do now? We stick to the plan. We wait for Hannah to get here. And if anyone needs a piss, you do it in the corner of the room. What about Chels? She's fine. She's next door. I don't know. Drop her a text and tell her to sit tight. She ain't going to be happy. And that's your problem? She ain't happy. She's with you. How isn't she perpetually miserable? Oh, check out Billy Big Bollocks over here. If I'm such a twat, then why isn't my missus cheating on me with a teacher? Oi! Sorry, I didn't... Skip! Take break! He's gonna have a smoke. Dickhead. I'm sorry, babe. It was fucking scary in there on my own. Don't do it again. Jesus Christ, are you not just gonna stand and bicker all night? Let's get a move on before he comes back. Anything? Nothing weird. What were you expecting? Child porn to pour out of his bag? You're about as useful as a cock flavoured lollipop. Do you know that? <laughs> I got his phone. See if you can find the evidence on it. You too, keep a lookout. Why would you let her speak to me like that? <sighs> Leave it out. I'm being serious, Danny. She talks to me like I'm a piece of dirt. You got gobby and she slapped you down. Don't get pissy about it and don't cause drama. Drama? Hey, Stu, I'm you your girlfriend. For a cigarette? You're... Hello? No, I can't crack it. Why not? I'm not a fucking hacker, I don't know his pin. You hacked Hannah's. Well, yeah, it was her birthday. Hang on. Try this. 240882. No, it didn't work. Oh, bollocks. He's on the next floor up looking for Stu. Give me the phone. What the fuck are you doing? 
I'm done standing around with my thumb up my ass. Hannah isn't even here yet. Oh, for all we know, he's going to meet her outside in his car to take her away. I'm not risking it. All of you, hide in a separate room. When he comes back, we'll have him surrounded. And if he tries to leave before she gets here, we'll trap him. I'm not sure about this. Yeah, I'm not separating from Chelsea again. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ben, take the room by the exit. If he comes your way, block him. You two, take a room at the end. I'm standing in the middle. And put your fucking masks on. If you are, you won't be for long. Mm. Smile for your audience. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, it appears this man had a scheme for tonight. Ah! What are you doing? What am I doing? Why didn't you tell everyone else what was supposed to be happening tonight? Please, why are you doing this? Playing dumb. Oh, that's okay. I'll whip out the evidence soon enough. Please. Right now, I'm streaming live for the whole world to see. Here's your chance to confess. This is live! <laughs> and in glorious Technicolor. Help me! Please, I'm being held hostage! <laughs> Dude, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Seriously, what the fuck is your problem? You didn't need to hit him. It was a love tap. I think he's getting off pretty lightly, all things considered. We need to call the police, now. No, we don't. We stick to the plan and we wait for Hannah to get here. The plan? The plan became redundant the minute you knocked him out. How the fuck are we going to catch him in the act now? Easy, we've got the Texas evidence. And if he refuses to speak, I'll beat it out of him. That's not how this stuff works. This mask's so hot I can't breathe. Don't take it off, not yet. Does it even really matter anymore? Yeah, I don't want this prick to see our faces. Seriously, what the fuck is your problem? This guy wants to rape your girlfriend and all you're worried about is me hitting him around some more. I only wanted to be there for Hannah. Not to get involved with this shit. You don't think he deserves it? Probably. I don't know. I just wasn't expecting it. If you don't want to be part of this, then leave. The three of us can do it without you. I'm here for Hannah. We're all here for Hannah, and to stop this guy doing the same thing to anyone else. So put your mask on and grow a set.
called Keezer. Check out the comments on the live stream. <laughs> Who's in this? <laughs> All right, fuck face. It appears our viewers want me to inflict a bit more pain on you. Let's take some requests. Big Boy 97 says, smack him around a bit more. If you mess up his face, he won't be able to track kids anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Never let it be said that I don't give people what they want. Hello. A bit late for you to be here. I left some books behind. Mr Shaw said he'd be here for me to pick them up. OK. He's upstairs. You know where you're going? Yeah, thanks. <sighs> to be fair, I would. Hello, please wait, it's me. Ben! Hey, please wait. What the hell is going on? Right, I can explain. Stop it, Eve. Stop it right now. Why? Scared I'm going to hurt your little boyfriend? It's not like that, you stupid prick. Then why are you here in the middle of the night meeting up with this guy? I can't tell you. Why? You wouldn't understand. Come on, sweetie. It's okay. Do you want to go outside and talk? Get away from everything? Honestly, not what you think, Chels. I'm not sleeping with him. I believe you. I just want to talk. There's nothing to talk about. When did it start? Did you initiate it or did he approach you? Just drop it. Oh, bollocks to this. <laughs> tell me the truth. Why are you here tonight? Are you okay? I'll be fine. I'll get up. Don't tell them anything. Stop it! Eve, leave it. And you can shut the fuck up. You make me sick. So big and tough hitting someone while they're tied up. Dad would be ashamed of you. Dad. Dad would have been here with me right now. He'd have killed the cunt with bare hands. You're pathetic. That's rich. Silly little girl. Can we please just talk about this? This is just as much your fault as it is hers. Babe. Wait a sec. Oi, leave her alone. Don't fucking touch her. Touch her again, I'll snap her. Look, calm down! Ow! Bitch! Oh, for fuck's sake! Take them over there and sit them down. Chelsea, keep an eye on them. And if you move, I'll put you right back down again. Park your asses and hand me your phones. I've lost my phone. You had my phone? I'm trying to protect you. Well, you're doing a brilliant job. Me and you now. No cameras. Just tell me the truth. The truth? Just admit that you're a pedo and we'll call it a day. <laughs> this isn't funny. Oh, it's hilarious. You and your gang of misfits believe you know what you're doing. Really? Illuminate me then. Eventually, you're going to have to let me go. When you do, this is going to end horribly for you. Let me guess. You're going to call the cops and get us done for assault? <laughs> guess if I'm going to get in trouble for this, may as well make it count. Tell him to admit that he's a pedo scumbag that wants to fuck my little sister and then I'll leave him alone. He's not. You are so naive. I know what men want, especially dirty pervs like this. You know fucking nothing. Excuse me? You heard? You act like you're the smartest person in the room, but you never stop and take a breath and actually look what's happening around you. 
Tell me, oh wise one, what exactly is happening? I've got no fucking idea. But at least I'm not arrogant enough to assume that I do. You're the one that bought me the messages in the first place. I said we should go to the police. <laughs> we shouldn't even be here. No, Danny, leave him. It appears Benny Boy has grown some balls for once in his life. Let's see if he knows how to use them. Oh, typical. You can't get the room to side with you, so you've got to use your fists. To shut up your pathetic whining. Why? Am I making sense? Does that scare you? Why are you even scared of you? That is not what I said. That's what it sounded like to me. Don't. Come on. Come on, hard man. Try and scare me. I'm telling you. You're telling me what, pussy? Both of you, pack it in. Leave them, babe. Oh! Gobshut. Are you seriously going to let this carry on? Are you kidding? This is the most fun I've had in ages. I've got 20 quid on Eve if you want to make a bet. We could be a bell end sometimes. I wouldn't bet on Ben either if I was you. Get off me! Are you gonna stop? No! You're gonna make me do it again. Alright, alright, I give. You two gonna kiss? It's off, you dickhead. You wanna fight me next? You're all being pathetic! Am I the only one with an ounce of sense? <laughs> I've got an ounce of weed. They're gone, they're fucking gone! Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, bollocks. Right, you two, head down, let Juno, make sure he's got all the doors locked. Then head to the top floor and work your way down. Yes, boss. Come on, babe. We'll search this floor. You search it yourself. I hope they escape. I've gone fucking mad. Suit yourself. Stay here while some kiddie fiddler runs off with Hannah. Can we leave? Please. This whole thing has gone to pot. Let's just find them first. I promise I'll take you home after. How can you let her speak to me the way she does? Who? Eve. She's a moody cunt and she always has been. She don't mean nothing by it. What does it matter? You're my girlfriend. You're supposed to stick up for me. Stu! That's it. Change the subject. But he's not here. I can see that. Numpty. His computer's still on and his phone's still here. He's probably taking a shit. I'll leave him a message and then we can look for him upstairs. You stay down here. In case he comes back. I'm gonna go upstairs. You wanna split up? I wanna find them as quick as possible so we can get out of here. I'll call you if I find anything. Charles, look. I'm really sorry about tonight. If you can't find him upstairs, I promise I'll take you home after. Give me a kiss. No joy. Oh, come on, man. This has gone way too far. We need to call the police. You sound like a broken record. You sound like someone who's too stubborn for their own good. I'm just trying to look out for Hannah. I know. I know your heart's in the right place. But you've gone about this the complete wrong way. I don't know how else to do it. I'm just trying to make sure she doesn't do something stupid. Someone stupid like dating me. <laughs> I love you, man. I was chuffed to bits when you two started going out. Really? I thought you hated it. Mm. It was weird at first, but you're my best friend. I trust you. Then trust me now. Come on, you know how much I love Hannah. You know how much this whole thing has been killing me. Please. Look, Danny's got our phones. When she comes back up, I'll call the police. Oh, thank you.
And I love you too, by the way. Well, things don't work out between you and Hannah. We could always go on a date. Oh, we're keeping it in the family, are we? To be fair, I've always rather fancied your mum. <laughs> <laughs> I take that back. I fucking hate you. <laughs> I found a first aid kit. You shouldn't have gone out alone. Don't be silly. You're hurt. I told you I'll be fine. They're idiots. But you can't blame them for thinking what they are. No. You can blame me for this fat lip, though. You should have told her the truth. You know we can't do that. It has to be better than this. No, Hannah. It'll take a thousand beatings to protect this. But what if they get the police involved? Well, they can't be that stupid. They must realise they'd be in a world of trouble if they did. I am really worried about her, you know. Danny and Chelsea will find her. It'll be all good. Who is it you're trying to convince? Stu! Oi! Dickhead! Who the fuck are you? You can fuck right off. Trouble, do you think I'm in? I don't know. A lot? Oh, I'm proper fucked. He may not press charges. And I mean, if he is actually, uh, you know, a pedo. Jesus Christ, you scared me! We have to get out of here right fucking now! Did you find Hannah? No, come on! I'm not leaving without her! Yeah, neither am I! Heading out. Going somewhere nice? Going to meet Danny for a bit. Probably won't be back till late. What are you wearing that for? I'm going for the goth look. Do you like it? Definitely more of a pastel shades girl. See you later, Mum. See you later. Chelsea! 
Let's go find Hannah. Fucking hell! Oh, oh my god, shells! Ben? Look. Mate, we need to get out of here. I can see figures outside. Do you think it's them? Who else would it be? Sorry. No, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have snapped. It's okay. Tonight should have gone a lot differently. Everything will be okay. Let's give it time. We need to get to a phone and call the feds. No shit. Yeah, don't be a smart ass. We need to find a weapon to defend ourselves. We're in a school, numb nuts. What, you think we're gonna find shotguns hidden away in the stationery cupboard? Yeah, maybe. What? So they're gonna hide them there in the unlikely scenario that when a bunch of maniacs attack the school, they can think, hey, let's fucking arm the students. Oh, let's just hope Danny uses a melon and phones for some help. Jesus, Chubbs! Fuck you, cunts! Right, I'm off. Mm. Tell Stu I said hello. Will do. Um, I'll probably be in bed by the time you get back. I'll uh, see you tomorrow after work. Don't work too hard. <laughs> Never do. <laughs> see you tomorrow. Mm. Proud of you, kidder. Cheers, soppy bollocks. Search one floor at a time. Yeah, if we don't get caught first. You ready? Not really. Come on. What if we don't find her? We will. What if they've already found her? They haven't. What if they find us before we find her? Look, Hannah's the priority, not us. A very good idea. Get out of here. What? Go, get out of here. We'll keep this wanker busy. Leave. Hannah's the priority, not us, remember? Go! Go!
brave, very brave, but your bravado is not enough to deflect my blade. You talk too much. <laughs> Silly little girl. Oh, thank God! Where's Eve? She's, she's on the next floor down. Come on, we've got to go. What's going on? These, these fucking people! They've killed Chelsea. You're scaring me. We need to leave. Oh, quick, get in here. What's going on? This is ridiculous. Hannah, he's clearly trying to lure me back to your sister. Fuck you. I helped you escape. Anything could have happened between then and now. Yeah, Chelsea died, Danny's gone, and who the fuck knows where Eve is? We have to help her. Oh, no way, Hannah. We need to find a phone and call the police. Oh, perhaps if we still had our phones, we wouldn't be in this predicament. Perhaps if you two weren't sneaking around... Will you around... two just shut up? Ben, you're scaring me. I don't want to leave without Eve. Neither do I. But she sacrificed herself so I could get you to safety. Let me do that. Okay. So what's the plan, Snowflake? We leg it out the room, down the corridor and the stairs, and we get out of the building. Oh, fucking hell. If this is a trick... You don't have to come! I don't give two shits about you! I'm here for her, not you! Look, let's just go. You two can fight outside. Ben, if this is a lie... Mr. Havisham? To be fair, you deserved that for the detentions you gave me. Prick. Mm. 
See that dickhead? Still think I'm bullshitting? How are we going to get out? There's so many of them. You can do this. Sorry guys, can I get past? I really need the toilet. What are they doing? No, no, no! We have to help her! We can't. They'll kill us. No more jokes, girl. I just want to find my sister and go home. Now you know that won't happen. You belong to me now. We can't get past them. We'll have to go back up. Where are we going to hide? Anywhere we can. We've just got to keep moving. What the fuck are you doing? My lord? My son? Quite the escapade tonight, Nathaniel. Decided to invite more of your students? Apologies, my lord. These children were unexpected. Where is the young girl? Hannah, come on. Let's go. Hannah? No, no, don't! Hannah, run! Go! Get out of here! I'm here, oh lord. My child? What are you doing? What was happening? Is this one with you? They followed me here. Hannah. You've always been an idiot. Rushing into situations without thinking. Fists forward, head up your ass. Nathan wasn't bringing me here to have sex, you simpleton. I was just trying to protect you with family. This is my family now. Tonight, I take my rightful place amongst the elite of society. No longer held down by you and our bitch of a grandmother. Why do you think it only right that before you become a part of this family, you release yourself from the shackles of your old one? Agreed. Time to come of age, child. Become my daughter. It will be my honour. Hannah, please. Not like this. But you want to look out for my best interests. This is what's best for me. <laughs> Dinner was blinding. Thanks, Nan. Mm. Mm. Still waiting to see you cook. <laughs> yeah, I love you far too much to poison you. <laughs> I'm off out. You doing anything tonight? Oh, I thought I might just fling on some glad rags, wander down the casino, and pick myself up a nice high roller. Oh. Run off to Monte Carlo. Oh, boring night then. Yeah, might just watch my mm. program instead. Hannah's out too, so I'll be all on my own. Sad. Oh, don't guilt trip me, Nan. I'm joking. <laughs> I can't cook for toffee, but I can order us a mean kebab. Oh. Tomorrow night? Sounds nice. It's a date. I'll probably be late tonight. Okay, I'll be in bed. Time you get in. All right then.
Right, love it. See you later. Bye. Give me the knife, my child. There is one more. May I, my lord? Do not allow him to escape. Thank you. I will not fail. <laughs> Come to me, boy. I promise it'll be quick. Ish. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! You killed my friends. You turned my girlfriend into a monster. I bet you wish all I wanted to do right now is fuck the little old hoe. Eh? In fact, if I promise to let you go, I bet you'd happily watch me take her virginity right in front of you. Hannah. I've got a better idea. Oh, oh. Colour me intrigued. Me and you, one on one. I win, you let me go. <laughs> oh. Your naivety is endearing. You and I will be going head to head. You won't be going home tonight. Your corpse and the corpses of your friends will be burnt on a pyre somewhere no one will ever discover. Ah! Ah! The bodies have been removed, my lord. Excellent. The boy is stirring. A shame for he would much rather be unconscious for what happens next. You hear that, boy? Should have stayed asleep. Finish him, son, and then we shall move on to the ceremony. My joining ceremony, Ben. It's why we're all here tonight, to see me take my place with my new family. Not quite, little one. What are you doing? Time for the truth, sweet girl. They're not here for you. They're here for me. To witness my ascension. Only for me to do that, I have to spill virginal blood. That wasn't the deal. What is it with you children and your deals? You have nothing to offer us. You're a fucking idiot. Oh, says the boy inside to the chair about to have his throat slit. Says the guy that thinks he's about to slaughter a virgin. He, he's right. I'm not a virgin. What? No. You said! Is it true? Hannah and me? Neither of us are virgins. Hannah, babe, I, I know he said we keep it a secret, but considering the circumstances... You said I had to be a virgin to join the family, so I lied. You little slut! Displeasing. Congregation, dispose of them both. Pleasure. Wait! I killed a virgin tonight. Eve, my sister, she was a virgin and I took her life. I did something by accident that he couldn't do with weeks of planning. Let me take his place. Take my place. You're a child! I'm an integral part of this society! Tonight, the ascension is yours. You have proven both your worth and your fealty. Thank you. Master, you can't be serious! You dare question me! Stay every year in remembrance of your sacrifices. Please, Hannah. Oh, I 
don't tell anyone. I'll, I'll join you, I promise. I just want to go home. My lord? I'm sorry, child, but sacrifices must be made. I understand. Please. I love you. I love you too. Tonight is your night, your celebration. This is your new beginning. Amen.